What's going on everybody? My name is Sam Sony. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this YouTube channel, I focus on two different things, faith and entrepreneurship. I'm really excited that you got a chance to come. If it's your first time in my channel, consider subscribing. In 2018, one of my goals really has been, how can we focus on discipline, mastering the basics, and really trying to do and accomplish the things that God has for us in this particular year? Maybe you've heard people talk about this last year, the year before, it's my year and things like that. And I, I took a vow this year to become more focused on accomplishing the goals that I really want and not just being complacent and not just being accepting that because everybody is hyped and excited about this year that I should be hyped and excited about the same thing as they are. You have your own course, you have your own purpose. How different this year will be for you if you are focused on the things you have to do versus what your friends, your family, your colleagues, your church, society says is, is it has to be. So as I was reading the scriptures, uh, our main scripture this year is out of 1 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 24 to 27. When Paul talks about, you know, running the race, not just to run the race, but to win the prize. See, that sounds exciting. I want to run, I want to run to win the prize. But then verse 25 and 26 come with the caveat and he gives an example. He gives a, an example of a comparison to athletes. He says athletes discipline their body very hard so that they can win a prize or they can win a crown that's going to fade a crown on earth you see how much more us we should win a, we're going to get a prize a crown that's going to be forever but see the first part of it is very is very important where he says actually disciplined our body very hard it is so important that he repeats it in verse 25 he says i discipline my body very hard so that I may be able to win the prize. So that at the end, when it's all said and done, I may not be disqualified after preaching the gospel. So this is the same message I have for you this year, 2018. Are you gonna take the challenge of disciplining yourself this year so that you can be able to win and achieve the goals you have? Do you? Will you will you jump on this journey with me? Don't worry, you're not gonna go by yourself. I I I took on myself the discipline to walk with you guys on this journey as well. So this year, hold me accountable to being practical every week we're going to be having a video that i really want to do every week a, a new video i am even have something in store i might be doing more than just uh one video a week but staying disciplined to provide enough solutions for you guys so that when you come you can be able to say you know what i've mastered the basics not trying to do the fancy stuff not trying to do what everybody does not trying to you know being like everybody trying to do no can you master the small things that matter can you listen to god's voice and obey what exactly he's telling you to do not your family not your girlfriend not your husband not your wife what he's telling you to do not your boss but you what is he telling you to do right is it through your school is it through your relationship is it through your business is it through what you're trying to do are you really called to be an entrepreneur like is your faith with god are you really called to that pastoral role are you called to be in ministry or is it just like an itch or is it what's cool now so these are things that we're going to be talking about it's going to be an interesting year so i'm glad you jump on the journey but my goal with this journey i want to be obedient as god told me take the discipline to be able to help people change their life this year I'm doing so. I hope you join me on this journey. So this video is simply to tell you that for you to achieve the goals you want, it's going to take discipline. It's going to take, how can I put this? Treating your body hard. <laughs> I hope that doesn't discourage you. And maybe if it does, maybe you're not cut up for it. If it doesn't, you have something in store, something big that God has in store for you. That's all that I have. These are the perks of uh, living in Florida. It is January right now, it's the winter is cold, but the beautiful thing is, as you can see, it's a little chilly than usual, but it's still nice outside. But that's all that I have for you. Remember, you're God's very best. Remember to click subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.